Hello, everybody. It is me, and it is Scotty. We're back watching some more Bar Rescue. I really don't have a lot else to say about it, other than I really wish that that marriage... What is it? Marriage Rescue? You enable oh, wow. him, Lena. Bravo. Lena. He's screaming. You I can scream, him. too! She don't enables. play that game with me! She don't enables. play yeah. that game with me! You're don't cool. play that game you with me! Fool. Did it get released? It was like six episodes, one season. Okay. If you guys want to see us watch Marriage Story for a video, or Marriage Story, Jesus Christ, that's the movie. <laughs> Marriage Rescue. Please leave a comment. Maybe we'll do that. But for now, we're going to watch the world's grossest appetizers. Well, not the world's. Bar Rescues. I don't, you know what? Before I even hit play, you know what my favorite thing about this show is? Before I hit record, I was talking about how I've been doing nothing but cringe videos. And we need to find something that's at least funny for people to watch. But they're going to keep yep. doing poorly. This is clearly a 4K camera with fake scan lines put on to look like CCTV. Yeah. And they do it all the time. And I love it. That's the kind of cringy stuff I was talking about with the show. Like, come on, bro. So unnecessary. Why are you even doing that? Like, <laughs> you're not fooling anybody. Potatoes are raw. Yeah. Yeah. Look at <laughs> John's unhappy. face. He was slack jaw looking like a Neanderthal in that car. Oh, that's gross. Don't eat that cat. Are they saying the wings are raw? With the chicken? It's yeah. Raw. It's just medium rare, you idiot. People these days always wanting their meat well done. SMH. Are you worried about some salmon vanilla disease? You'll be fine. Yeah, look at Tyler. He's, he's survived for the most part. A little dumber, but could be worse. Could be Nogla. <laughs> <laughs> Nogla's always catching strays over on my channel. I'm sorry, yep. buddy. That's raw. It's raw. Oh, that's gross. Don't eat that. How do you f that up? Because the script told you to. I don't know. <laughs> Look at that face. The dude looks like he's mid mummification. Utter disgust. He literally looks like the wax figurine. You know that, that museum that has those? Yep. This looks like the wax figurine version of John Taffer. <laughs> now, that's what my hairline's gonna look like soon, bro. Actually, mine is worse. Oh god. It looks good. How's that cheesesteak? He's a good looking no fella. Okay. There's no look at all these steak. dude, look at Dang Wait, it. hold on! Where did they go? Weren't they there the shot before? Oh, watch watch the CCTV Johnny. line, Scott. I think we found an inconsistency. No way. How's that cheesesteak? Oh, I thought they had him here. Do they have him on this camera? Dang it. Okay, well I guess it's the camera that's right in front of them where they obviously see it. They take off the, the lines. I got you. They're gonna go right there to that. This one clearly isn't a security camera, it's just somebody holding it. But if they know this camera's there, why even put the security lines on the other camera? <laughs> the one that's the like, same resolution, quality, and everything? I don't know, man. They're just like, oh, we turned it off, guys, and then they play the other camera. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I'm so sorry to interrupt, but I wanted to talk to you about something important. That thing is money. Cash. That good old green, baby. Now, if you're anything like me, you have a bunch of monthly subscriptions for, like, video streaming services for people on Twitch or... I don't know, whatever you're into. And until I used today's video sponsor, Rocket Money, I had no idea just how alarming that number was. So thank you. <laughs> Rocket Money is an all-in-one finance platform that helps you save more and spend less. This personal finance app allows you to manage subscriptions, lower bills, build a custom budget, and grow your savings. All in one magnificent place. Big draw for me was the canceling of the subscriptions. Now I know that I have a lot each month that's reoccurring, I didn't know how many there was. So not only does that help me put a number on that, but it can actually help you cancel them as well. Now, I don't want to just give the impression that Rocket Money is only used for subscriptions and monitoring them and canceling them. It does tons of other things. On top of monitoring your credit and giving you notifications of when your score changes and things that impact it, it also tells you things to help grow your credit score because that's ultimately what you want to do with your finances, baby. Them. Another fantastic feature for absent-minded hooligans like myself is the budgeting, which I'm not showing my own because privacy reasons, but you can set limits on things, get notifications when you surpass them. Also get a sweet visual breakdown of your spend earn ratio by like quarter, month, hell you can see the whole year. And again, these are just a few of the features of Rocket Money. This is not everything. There is even more to see and explore. That was a sweet ride. Keep all of your money and your dimes. <laughs> to save more and spend less, join 3.4 million members over on Rocket Money. Start taking your finances by the horns! I've got the goods for you, as you know. Go to rocketmoney.com slash panda, or just go on down in the description and click that link. Get yourself started for free, or unlock even more wonderful features with Panda. That's rocketmoney.com slash panda to get started for free. Get your money right, baby, and let us 
get right back to the video. We're watching, this is the video about grossest appetizers, right? So we need to make sure we find out what he actually ordered. The comments will be angry. How's that cheesesteak? No Philly cheesesteak. Okay. Oh, no well, Philly he's not getting steak. that. Dang it. Okay, we'll do the nacho fries and turkey melt. I'm gonna give you guys nacho this. Nacho fries? Nacho fries and it sounds like a turkey melt, so like a turkey sandwich. If you fuck up french fries, bro. I didn't think I mean, obviously could be they messed do, up, but... It's gotta yeah. be, it, I wonder, oh, they gotta be like soggy ass french fries and some like nasty, like that fake fondue cheese. Ugh. Some like some of them little bacon bits that you get at the Kroger aisle and they're dry. Chewy. Um, Where do I, do I get up? They're gonna go right there to that. It makes me want to go to okay, Jack so Brown's and get like actually good fries. Okay, so like, <laughs> yeah. Right Can you like ring a bell rather than like screaming out across the bar? Oh, dude, that. Is that cheese? Yeah. No, dude, that's, that's the just oil. Dirty ass oil. Oh my god, it literally looks like gravy. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I just see all that bubbling up, and I'm just thinking somebody's gonna eat that. When you see smoke like that coming out of the oil. That's because of all the debris in the oil, correct? Yes. Have you ever worked in the kitchen, Scott? Yes, I have. You understand how disgusting that is. <laughs> that is vile. I see. I always worked front of house, but I was always that front of house server that was cool with everybody in the kitchen, so they didn't kick me out right away. That's disgusting, dude. It's I'll fucking it brown. <laughs> yeah. It's disgusting. Part of me wonders, like, how much of this stuff is potentially staged for the show. That shit's been there a long time, dude. Like, yeah. They would have had to a truck in a nasty fryer with oil. That is real. That is disgusting. <laughs> yeah, is... people are eating from that. I mean, you bet you them fries got a lot of seasoning on them. <laughs> oh, oh, God. It looks like cheese, bro. Oh. That's the worst we've ever seen, Mike. Yeah. Luckily, he was standing right there. I mean, that's Oops. a serious fire hazard. Fire? That happens often if he was ready. I mean, I understand that you're worried about fire. Yeah, I see what you're saying, Scott. Yeah, they haven't changed the oil since that guy started working there in the 80s. Yeah, this is just part of his routine is check the fries, make sure the building's not catching on fire. <laughs> Oh my lord, I think they're making the turkey melt now. I, I, mean, I don't want to talk a over it. Fire hazard. Look, it looks like he's... <laughs> How gross is that Hormel? Is no gloves on. He's been touching everything in that disgusting kitchen. Now you're touching someone's cold cuts? Yeah. And there's our and it's literally like a deli sandwich that I made no for my pack of lunches. Any of this is happening. <laughs> wow, he looks like a miserable owner. He does. There's that cheese outside. The cheese, the cheese <laughs> looks <laughs> like the, the fucking fryer. oil. He's taking the cheese, oh! some water to it. Very special recipe going on here. That's not real cheese. I mean, honestly, this looks like a joke. Gross, fake nacho cheese. Hey, that was greasier than my face back in middle school. Like, <laughs> yeah. It was so wild. Yeah, so that is vile. Have you seen him do anything Oh my tonight? God, dude. All right, we're going in. Look Those at that, man. Oh, oh they're my doing God. It? They're doing it? Cheese kind of tastes like water. Now, I didn't ask them. Literally, does he know? Right it's a little weird. There's like a bitter aftertaste. Oh my what? god. What? Uh. I, I can't watch this anymore. Somebody's gonna get sick. Stop Here comes John. Here, Here we go. Here we go, baby. Yeah, it's really about to get. It's a little funky, man. <laughs> Dude, he came in there with his arms moving like he's ready to start throwing punches. Did you see that shit? Have you seen that scene in Mission Impossible where Henry Cavill, like, loads his arms up he like punches forward like he's cocking guns no that's what it looks like when john here he literally cocks his arms like they're guns like before he punches them watch you'll see it <laughs> <laughs> gotta make sure them shit's loaded brother he's just adjusting his sleeves obviously but it looks like he's loading that shits <laughs> up but god i forgot how over the top that, mo that movie is pretty sure that's what john does when he walks in through the door I got a little bit of that yeah, on his yeah. arm. It's a little funky, man. Yeah, a little it, flick. It was minor. A little that flick of the wrist. I saw the look on your face. Oh, he knows who he is. He's like, oh shit, that's Big John. Nadia. Oh, yes, sir. I'd like you to meet American authors. Hi. Hi, how are you? Hi, guys. How are you? What book did they write? I don't know who they are, honestly. I'm, oh, I'm assuming it's a band, but when you're- That's I, my best guess. It was a low-hanging fruit. I had to make <laughs> that joke. Yep. Look how enthused he is to meet that lady. He's like, oh, wow, hello! <laughs> it's great to meet you! Did you- have you read my book? <laughs> oh, man. I'm fucking I'm cracking myself up. I have brain damage. Edible or not? No. Wow. Uh, talking about the food, dude. Talking about the food, dude. Is that what he actually sounds like? This guy definitely celebrates 420 every day. Talking about the food, dude. <laughs> like and I've been on my hands and knees scrubbing the floor. The floor was like that all the really? way Really? What about that? I did not finish. 
So that's like changing a baby's Jesus. diaper, but not between the cheeks of his ass, because you don't see it. <laughs> <laughs> this is why John is my favorite, bro. What a line. Uh, oh, man. That's gold. <laughs> changing a baby's diaper, but not between the cheeks of his ass, because you don't see it. Will you eat that food? No, I don't want to eat that food. I don't so if you won't eat it, how do you give it to them? My stomach hurts. I feel like I can't believe I just ate this nonsense. <laughs> Yeah. They couldn't have gotten him to read that line again. My stomach hurts. I'm, I'm eating this nonsense. <laughs> My stomach hurted. That is terrible. That line delivery was as rough as her bangs. How do you give it to them? My stomach hurts. I feel like I can't believe I just ate this nonsense. <laughs> Thank you. Lindsay, my pleasure. So this is the QR. You'll have to scan it. <laughs> Where the fuck is John now? What happened to the van? Now he's in some sort of in FBI building? Room. Yeah. Look to the left. I was distracted by that. Is that a DSLR lens just sticking out of the curtain? <laughs> yeah, I think that's for his reaction. But I don't know why it needs to be hidden like that. Bro, this you nailed it. This is a John Taffer reaction video. <laughs> We're reacting to John reacting. He is the OG. Sorry, I got distracted, but oh, I don't want to see that again. Yeah. <laughs> All the menus there, but definitely recommend trying amiibos here. Each amiibo is only half a pound. Half a pound meeple? Yep. Yeah. One. Yeah. Did she say uh, only meatball. half a only pound? Only half a pound. She's like, oh, only half a pound. If you get the entree, it's a full pound meatball. They just bring out a <laughs> fucking bowling ball made out of beef. <laughs> <laughs> I want at least three of those on top of my pasta. Dude, I'm not going to lie. I would fuck that thing up. Can you imagine the macros on a one pound meatball? <laughs> God damn! That's my meal prep. This is a bunch of bowling balls of meat wrapped up in my freezer. <laughs> you just order seven a week, one for each day. <laughs> just put it in the air fryer for 35 minutes. <laughs> a half a pound meatball. It's like a meatloaf. I'm, my man's literally got a reaction studio, dude. I can't get over it. <laughs> he's just sitting there talking to himself. At least when he's in the car, he's got people to talk to. Oh, no, yeah. he's just sitting there like, a oh, half pound meatball. I can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Holy shit, why is it green? What? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me get a screenshot of that one. <laughs> That's worth keeping. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying. Like, through the sauce, it almost looks green. Yeah. What's wrong with it? I think that led us to seeing better days. Is there paprika or something in, in this dressing? What's the, like, the yeah, what are these dudes thing? doing? You see they the are colors. creeping. It's a little brown. Yeah. I'm How just trying to brown? figure out. All I was saying is, like, I was saying, if there's a spice Hold on a second, I thought I saw brown, something. Yeah. I'm just... Oh, I see something. Damn, bro. They got four jars of sauce on that counter. That's crazy. <laughs> I didn't even see those. That's crazy, too. <laughs> what color is the hair? No. <laughs> it's a freaking disaster. This, yeah. is, this is a Nico's freezer. We've been selling this for close to 20 right, but years. This, yeah. But it still looks yeah. like shit. I just asked a simple question. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine, like, trying to have this normal conversation with this guy and he's just in your ear? Tell him it looks like shit. I could not. My man has never used a microphone before in his life. He's like, tell him it looks like shit. Gotta put the whole thing in his mouth. Come on, John. Look, man, it's your restaurant. You should season. be passionate. My name I, get is it. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. You know. So I defend it. I've seen everything I need to see. I'm gonna go in there before Jason and the owner. Where is he? I would have guessed a back room, but I don't know. Did they did they set this man up with a room inside of the restaurant? That would be incredible. And they just had no idea. What do you mean? How do you not have look at this, this man's got more fucking monitors than like the, the police headquarters in this room. They're fucking big too. Look at this shit. Those are full screen TVs. And they're the blue there's the blueprint for the restaurant. There's only three rooms. <laughs> one yeah, huge one and two be? little ones. <laughs> Which one is in? Holy shit, dude. I didn't, I'd never seen the COVID episodes. I didn't know they did this. We have our bill, please. <gasps> He's just going to come around the corner. Yeah. I love your scissor salad. Anyway, oh, so I defend, I defend. I love your I scissor defend. salad. <laughs> I really love your Caesar salad. Nico, yeah. I love your Caesar salad. I love your Caesar salad. <laughs> Wait, you're telling me they don't see that GoPro strapped to the fucking counter? <laughs> Look at that thing! <laughs> what do you mean? None of these cameras around here have scan lines, Scott, which means none of them are hidden cameras. You're right. You don't notice the six foot eight angry East Coaster about to barge through oh, the back so I room? Defend, I defend Nico, <laughs> I defend what we have. Oh, they didn't show him coming in. What? How am I supposed to know where he was? I had to know if he was going to come from the back or if he was going to come through the front door and he was like next door or something. I want an order of mozzarella sticks, a couple of um, Swiss and bacon burgers, medium rare. Guarantee it will 
media rare or medium. Well, whatever. That's cooking 101. Right. Ooh, what can you guarantee? <laughs> that it's a burger? I mean, can we start there? That at least, yeah. You said cheese sticks. What was it? Sliders, basically? That's cooking 101. Right. <laughs> I love how he's just like, oh, whatever. Whatever. That's cooking 101. <laughs> right. Just bring me the fucking right, beef, so bitch. I don't care. Do you see the fries? Oh, more cheese. Dude. There's a vat of cheese. That one's worse. That literally... Oh, it literally looks like boiling Velveeta. It does. Like, you could pour some, like, some macaroni shells in there, and then you would have some sweet mac and cheese, but that is oil. That shit has not been changed in months. That is disgusting. I mean, the burger didn't look too bad. Yeah, not... Not all bad right, at so all. we got a few hamburgers going down. They're even toasting the buns. I do. It's bubbling. There is a layer of gunk on the oh bottom my. of that fryer. Oh. That is not How many places are like this? That's what I want to know. That's the downside of watching shows like this. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it almost makes you want to exclusively go to places that are open kitchen, like uh, like Chipotle or I guess Subway is an example, but they're just unpacking deli cuts. Yeah. Well, you don't really see Chipotle making, like, actually making the food. You just see them assembling it. Uh, well, yeah. Most of them have the kitchen visible behind them, I guess is what I'm saying, but not like this. Like, this makes me never want to order food at a bar. Not that I often would. If I'm drunk enough, I'm not going to give a shit. It's just maybe this is why I get sick every time I go out. Not because I had too much to drink because I ate shit like this. This definitely don't help. Okay, well, she's eating. So that's the cheese stick. Yeah. Look at that, look at her face. Yeah, she's chewing that over. <laughs> uh. That mozzarella that's so hard. She can barely swallow this. She's still working that thing. Yeah, they got a timer for her chewing. This is a world-class chew. She's in 40 seconds. <laughs> So you're gonna spit it out finally? Oh, so yeah. was she just waiting for the bartender to go? Did she commit it? I mean, you did. How do you fuck up a cheese stick, dog? They're probably not even making them. No. It's gotta be just the fucking oil. Oh. So one of the reasons last night that your mozzarella sticks weren't frying crispy was because there is a layer of gunk in here. Dude, I don't want to even see it. Oh my gosh. Oh. All of this. God, that's nasty. This grease dude, is what? disgusting. I'm gonna throw up, dude. <laughs> please, tell me, please tell me they added those sounded effects. The sounded. I can't, like, I'm so fucked up by it, I can't even speak properly. Those sounded effects. <laughs> Did you hear them squishy squashies, bro? Yes, I, I do not need to hear them again. I tell you that. I was really tempted. Are you sure? No, they, no. I, I, I'm sure, yes. Yes, I'm sure. All right. We'll hear what Tiffany had to say. What we gotta do is clean this freaking fryer. The fryer can't oh. work properly. Ah! <laughs> they did it again. <laughs> Why do they keep doing that, bro? I don't they like They really it. wanted to drive it home <sighs> of how disgusting it was, and it worked. Yeah, I mean, that's... Oh. <laughs> that's what's going bro. on. Bro! Bro! That literally looks like somebody pouring brownie batter into a pan. I don't think that that fryer has ever been cleaned. Bro, no. Where is Gordon Ramsay where you need him? Gordon and John need to team up together. Oh my God. And make a video called Fuck Your Rescue. <laughs> and they just come in and they're like, you know what? This is fucking shit. Then John is like, you didn't wipe your baby's ass. And then they just give each other a high five and burn the building down. <laughs> Oh, they didn't even get to the burger, bro. Are these all just gonna be fryers? I will be disappointed. Well, they said apps, so maybe the burger wasn't too bad. Oh, that's a fair point. Good call, good call. We have a mahi-mahi appetizer. Um, you like fish? The fish sounds kind of good. Good, the black and the white. Fried will be good. Okay. Doesn't sound like an appetizer, though. So one thing though. he definitely did, he just pulled them out of the fryer. Oh, yeah. is no it another towel. nasty fryer? No, nothing to absorb that extra grease. I think them out of the fryer, you seize them immediately and you get them on a drain pan. They weren't being drained, they weren't being seasoned. This guy looks like he has served some gabagool at his restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> the gabagool. <laughs> yeah, he, he definitely does the thing with his hand where he talks like this. Seize them immediately and you get them on a drain and pan. You fucking don't season them immediately. This, mo this motherfucker's name is Capone. You're gonna be swimming with the fishes. These fishes out of the fryer with their yeah. bubbling cheese grease. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So there's gotta be more. We gotta be seeing. God damn! Does she have a license for that fucking heavy machinery? <laughs> My bad. This is this is about mahi. I don't know. It's actually it's about appetizers, <laughs> and I think I'm seeing one right now. <laughs> that shit looks appetizing to me. What's up? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Okay, we gotta get through this video. See this close-up hidden camera? 
<laughs> yep. It's a dude standing right next to it with a giant 4K camera. He's just holding a piece of paper with lines on it in front like, of it. Uh, we need we need B-roll real quick. He's like in the fucking kitchen with his 4K. Was every so that one's not hidden camera here, which is clearly going to cut to the same. Look ago. at this. That's the same. That's the same camera, dude. He just got closer. Literally the same angle. <laughs> Oh man, does the footage of her walking in have it? No, okay. But this one does. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, dude. Oh my gosh, who's here in my food? Look at the hair. <laughs> oh no. John, he's like, look at the hair. There's no way you saw that hair on this fucking four by three footage, John. Oh my gosh, who's here in my food? Look at the hair. <laughs> Wait, we literally saw what he saw. There ain't no scan lines. <laughs> Fucking exposed! Yeah, you were to see, I bet you there's gonna be another nasty Sometimes ass fryer. This is in and out, so you know how it is. What is this? You see this, you know what it is. What? Is that chili? Or was that just clumpy, like clumpy grease? I'm pretty sure that's debris from the fryer. Just sitting there? I'm gonna go back. You see this? <laughs> Look yeah, the, that would make color. sense because there's some random fries, probably some chicken tendy pieces in there. Look at the color of the oil in both of those fryers, dude. Honestly, that looks infinitely better than the last ones. The last ones were fucking orange. We got to see what color the froth is. We got to see the frothy cheese. Oh, don't use you know that word. <laughs> I don't have that in my fryer. Yeah, so maybe you're not running a busy restaurant. No disrespect to the bamboo tiki bar. But, but, I'm running a busy restaurant. Right here. It's French fries. That's ass. That's ass. Yeah, that's ass. That's, <laughs> ass. that's ass. There's grease dripping out of the hood. Oh, oh. that looks like the residue from a volcanic eruption. That is what Pompeii looked like after it fucking leveled the city. And you got Mr. Oh Gabagool God. over here calling French fry debris ass. It's fucking ass, okay, <laughs> buddy? You keep telling me how often he cleans the kitchen, but I'm looking at him I'm like, who are you trying to kid here, guy? Yeah, who the fuck you think you're talking to? Do you know who I am? I'm fucking, I'm fucking Gabagool Capone. <laughs> my restaurant is busy as shit. I served it to your mother last night. I served my, my half pound meatballs on a plate. Shit, brother. All right, here we go. Last clip. Final lap. So they're going to microwave the chili. Did you see that? Yep. This is chili. Oh, oh brother. That's, they, they, okay, they definitely added sound effects for that. Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> So they're gonna microwave the chili. Did you see that? Yep. Especially after the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> dude! <laughs> they definitely added that shit, dude. Oh, oh, he's pimp strutting back in. Yeah, there he go. Brian Josh Taffer, how are you? Uh, nice to meet you. Good to meet you. Come on up. They had to tape up every logo in that bar, this bro. It had to be miserable. All of them. Look at that. That one. Or how are you? Uh, Wait for nice the Bud logo. Good to meet you. Come on up. I want you to make some Better than having to do it in this post. This is Maria Menounos. So yeah. You've ever Look at that. Extra? That Bud logo is just red tape. I still know what it is, though. So at least, Yeah, that's brand recognition. They did a good job. Hillbillies recognize that as meaning, we hate them. They support them homosexuals down there in the South. Hey, ain't nothing wrong being homosexual. I went to the liquor store the other day and literally my favorite beer was gone because they weren't buying any of the Bud products because of the trans support. Absolute <sighs> mindlessness. So, you didn't eat your potato skins. You love potato skins. I, love potato I know skins, that about yeah. you. Yeah. How many bites did you take? One. She didn't even Bacon take Bacon did look good. Bite. I would have eaten that. Yeah. You couldn't eat the chicken yeah. wings. It was raw. Raw. Yeah. Fucking John over here like a parrot. They were raw. Raw! <laughs> it's like, it like ad-libs on a rap song, dude. Chicken wings. It was raw. Yeah, true. Raw. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like if it's a Migos chick. Like a Mika Migos track, like, chicken was raw. Raw! Look at the filth everywhere. Look at the filth in here. Oh, boy. Look at the boy. filth in here. Ready for some more fryer it cheese? It's getting better, guys. No. This is your future. Look at it. Oh, John's throwing shit. Look you at the sludge oh, God. on the bottom of this grease. Do you want to eat this? Come on in, Kev. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. Dude, look at oh, that, that shit. Oh, that shot makes it look awful. It looks like fucking Shrek's swamp. <laughs> True. Look at that thing bubbling and shit, bro. About to see Donkey pop out of there. Oh. All you're doing is boiling food in old oil. That's look at dirty. That. That kind of looks like ravioli. That looks like some Chef Boyardee. <laughs> Probably not much healthier, honestly, the Chef Boyardee. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Dude, that looks like the au jus that you order with like a French dip. This is the chili that was on your fries 20 days ago this was made. 
God damn. Three weeks. Who knows if it was even like stored properly and stuff. Well, you know it wasn't. Yeah, based on everything else, you know it isn't. I'm willing to bet their walk-in, assuming they even have a walk-in, is like set like 10 degrees too high or something. If this bar is not clean when I come here in the morning, I will not rescue you. Do you understand that? Shut this bar down. Get these people out of here. He stops in the middle. Jesus Christ. He's like, hold on. This kitchen is disgusting. I have a marriage to rescue. <laughs> And then just runs off to another set. Plays a trailer. Oh, well, I never want to eat out again. At, at a restaurant, let me be clear here. Other forms of eating out is fine. Oh, talk dirty to me. Yeah, I, well, maybe I just won't be getting fried food at restaurants anymore. <laughs> yeah, that seems to be the common theme here. It's like when people watch like those, those PETA videos and they become vegetarian. I watch bar rescue videos and I become fried -itarian. Is that how that works? Yeah, I think so. Sounds right. Well, I don't, I don't want to watch anymore. That's okay with you. I'm, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for enduring this with me. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. You guys seem to have enjoyed the last bar rescue video, but I think maybe that was because there was boobs in it. I like boobs. Boobs are great. This one had butt cheeks in it, so it's a, it's a fair trade-off. Yeah, it did. If you guys want to see more, leave a comment. If you want to see the, the marriage rescue, leave another comment. And then uh, we'll be back soon with some more videos. Love you. Peace and chicken grease. Goodbye. Clean grease, by the way. It is clean grease. Yes. In my fryer. Or not grease, oil, whatever. Anyway, bye-bye.